Greetings, Planet Houston. I am General Zond, and may I wish you all a Merry Zondmas. Let us talk about this religious ritual that you all gather around and watch every year. The television. What better way to celebrate a man who wanted you to help the poor by staying inside your warm, cozy house and watching your very expensive cable? First of all, it should be known that on Krypton we do not have television. We mostly just stare at walls. Brightly colored walls, mind you! We have giant holographic images of our elders that stare at us in consternation. But thankfully no commercials. The first Christmas special I watched was called A Christmas Story. It was about a child who wished to procure a weapon. I admire his exuberance. But when he finally gets the bloody thing, the pipsqueak shoots his eye out. He would make a poor soldier indeed in my army. He will be peeling spuds while my cyber warriors and nail men do my bidding. Though I must admit, I think I got caught in a time loop. For this Christmas special seemed to keep playing over and over and over for exactly 24 hours. I fear it might have been the son of jor flying around the planet 24 times just to mess with me. You will stop forcing me from watching that damn kick is screwed by that Ovaltine commercial son of jor -El. However, I did find a strange attraction to this one special called the Grinch. I admire this Grinch and his constant determination to try and take over Christmas. A goal I respect. He is resourceful, but I fear I would not be able to shake his hand as he seems to be covered in a kryptonite dust. Clever boy. The next one I saw was called It's a Wonderful Life. Well, apparently it wasn't because he tries to off himself in the first part of the movie. I wouldn't mind except I wanted him to jump. That would have been the happy ending. The half man, half chair person would assimilate the town and I can respect that. Instead, we get some nonsense about every time a bell rings, an angel gets his wings. Well, on my planet Krypton, we have a saying too. Every time a Tarlactian blarg blarg roars, you get mustard on your sandwich. You'd have to be a Kryptonian to get that, or at least have Kryptonese. Then there came a Christmas Carol, again named after this strange woman I've never met. Though it did have an old man and his servant. Apparently Mr. Cratchit did not understand the whole master-slave relationship. You do not complain about a lack of coal, you kneel! You do not complain about your child's debilitating disease, you kneel! You do not shed tears when your child dies, you thank him for his benevolence. That's one less mouth to feed. That two pence will go much farther now. Why would you have so many children if you're a pauper to begin with. On planet Krypton, we are only allowed two children. The rest are sent off to backwater planets in crystal cocoons. We call it no child left to get rid of. The only Christmas special I found myself enjoying was the one called Die Hard that had death, destruction, a perfect Christmas film. The only downside is they killed the person with the goatee dressed entirely in black. I did not like this. Baldy McCann hold down a marriage gets off fine. But the terrorist gets killed? Now I've seen everything. Final sum up, Christmas specials have no place in the Zardonian People's Republic of Houston. Unless of course they star me in the Alan Rickman role. And I live. Now that's a happy ending. This is General Zard, and you will all kneel before me.